case briefs and so much more ls data's got what you're looking for in a landmark case that unfolded over several years two couples purchased a property with the intent of turning it into a residential home the four buyers however were handed a rude shock when they discovered that their newly acquired property violated local county subdivision ordinances disallowing their intended use of the property Prior to this revelation, the seller had presented deeds that divided the property equally amongst the four buyers, and it was upon this premise that the buyers had intended to use the properties for residential purposes. Unable to utilize their property as planned, the aggrieved buyers took the case to the Chancery Court. The court sided with the buyers, ruling that the deeds were in breach of implied warranties. On these grounds, the court awarded consequential damages and attorney's fees to the buyers. Frankly displeased by the stance of the Chancery Court, the seller chose to make an appeal disputing the alleged breach of implied warranties. Her argument was that the deeds were valid, and their purported violation of county subdivision ordinances did not hold water as the alleged indiscretions were not present at the time the property was conveyed. In a dramatic twist, the appellate court sided with the seller. The court ruled that the deeds were indeed valid and found no merit in the claim of a breach of implied covenants. As a result of this ruling, the court revoked the previously awarded damages and attorney's fees. The verdict was a double whammy for the buyers who not only found themselves unable to utilize the property as intended, but also had to bear the brunt of a reverse judgment. The case charted unexplored territory and property rights, underscoring the fine line between the validity of deeds and violations of local ordinances. It served to highlight the critical role of due diligence in property transactions. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit LSE.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.